Boom. Bel Air season two, baby. Here's a quick rundown of everything that's happened so far this season. Will returns to the mansion after Uncle Phil apologizes at Ashley's birthday party, and Sweetie pulls up to him. You know, that's kind of cool. Then Will breaks up with Lisa. Oof. Hillary bosses up in her influence group. Jeffrey was also kicked out of the mansion, but he and Uncle Phil make good. Ashley's teacher, Miss Hughes, aka Tatiana Frickin' Ali, gets fired for teaching outside the curriculum. So, the BSU, Carlton, and Will stage a protest to help get Miss Hughes' job back. Carlton's anxiety gets the best of him, and Will ends up the school hero. Oh, this whack dude named Drew comes into the picture, stirring things up with Carlton, and even starts eyeing Lisa. Drama. Carlton! Will still struggles to find his place on the Bel Air basketball team. So, he joins this AAU team and runs by this dude named Doc. Mr. Banks. Sketchy. Carlton gets nominated for the Founders Award, but so does Will. Carlton's anxiety spikes again. Aunt Viv has an art gallery that everyone loves. She's great. Things heat up with Will and Doc's niece, Jackie. Sorry, Lisa. Hillary's relationship is on the rocks with Jazz, and her ex, Lamarcus, comes back in the picture at the worst possible time. Jeffrey reunites with his son, Frederick. Got this, Chief. Will's world shakes up again when he finds out Doc isn't who he thought he was, and Jackie knew all along. Uncle Phil plans to save his company by teaming up with Erica Baker, but Aunt Viv obviously doesn't trust her backstabbing ex-best friend. <sighs> And Carlton relapses hard with Connor and starts lying to everyone, including Will. What you told me? This isn't what you think. Which leads us to episode 10, the finale. And y'all know we had to end things with a bang. So make sure you watch, because you'll never believe what happens next.